Hi, my name is Ken. I live in California. By and large, I've been a lifelong Republican, but on occasion I have broken with that tradition when the times have called for it. With the next general election, I will break with that tradition again. The times we are now dealing with have seen to that. This time I'll find somebody I can vote for whose name is not Donald J. Trump. We as a nation find ourselves struggling to deal with a pandemic that wants to ravage us and a U.S. president who doesn't care a whit about us. At the moment, I fear the actions of my president more than I do the savageness of the disease COVID-19. He only cares about himself. It's a double whammy for the nation. It has taken its toll on me and I suspect the rest of us. Now, I'm a Marine Corps veteran. I served honorably and I was discharged honorably. Throughout my service, I always respected my commander in chief. Now I'm shocked to hear Trump declare, more than once actually, that he only likes military folks who were not captured in the line of duty. I cannot relate to that, nor can I imagine any of my fellow Marines agreeing to that point of view. It's just bizarre, and it's especially perplexing to hear a commander in chief say he does not like or support a U.S. prisoner of war. I cannot imagine any commander in chief I served under, ever adopting that view about anyone who has served in our armed forces. These are strange times. Trump has wantonly abandoned the people who elected him and the even larger swath of the population to whom he is supposed to answer and support. He does not deserve a second term in office. Thank you.